Diggy Deviates, Dicky Devil here, and you're watching Dicky's Comic Crypt on HPUSA TV exclusively. Make sure you go down and hit that subscribe button for us so you can keep up to date with all of our new videos. So today I'm coming to you from the Comic Crypt and uh, I'm going to do an unboxing video for you because I just got my Kickstarter rewards from Still Ill Princess for Lil Six Cannibal Kitty and I'm super excited. So, shipped out from Coffin Comics, the distributor, packaged up nice. Let's uh, let's dig in, see what we got. I gotta be careful with this knife because these are comic books in here, collectibles. Uh, all right. Well, the first thing I see is one of the things I really was looking forward to from this, and that is uh, fuck yes, this amazing Cannibal Kitty T-shirt this way so you guys can see it there we go that art is out fucking standing so Lil Six Cannibal Kitty is uh, the creation of Dan Mendoza and Nightmare Lynch Dan the artist of Zombie Tramp among other things uh, Nightmare Lynch is the writer she is also an artist both awesome people uh, and guess what I have an interview coming up with them too I will review this book and I will have an interview with Dan and Nightmare exclusively for you guys. So real quick, because we always talk about our merch here, I just want to point out that this is on a next level shirt. This is super soft and comfortable. Man, this is awesome. I can't wait to rock this on stage at the next Dickie Devil and the Deviant show. That is so fucking cool. All right, digging in further. I did get the, uh, our opening? here we go. So I pledged and wanted one book specifically for this. Is, uh, this was the Kickstarter for issue number two of Little Six Cannibal Kid. So uh, I also grabbed a copy of signed issue number one there as well. But, all right, so let's go with the comics first. Let's break out these comics. So this is number one signed by Dan. And... Looks like signed by Nightmare Lynch as well. That in there, you can see the awesome art. So, the number one Cannibal Kitty comic. That was uh, an extra order. The main reason, oh boy, I better. Oh. Well, let's show you this one first. Here, I had to have this. This is the uh, Morticia homage cover. The Morticia Adams homage cover, which, there we go, centered. Still getting used to this backward stuff, all this new technology. I'm from Deadsville. We don't have this stuff. But look at that cover. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous. I hope they do prints because I want a print of this. Um, yeah, this is amazing. And signed by Dan and Nightmare, both down there, as you see. And then I also got the Risque version, and I will cover <laughs> cover the nipples for uh, for this. There is a uh, you know the risque version with it as well as Dan is known for. So I can't wait to read these. I had got the digitals, but it's not the same. I didn't want to read them just yet. I wanted to read the physical one first. Uh, so looking forward to those amazing art. And now the rewards. So whenever you do a Kickstarter with Dan, how you contribute, you uh, back Dan's Kickstarter, there's always rewards because he always goes way above and beyond whatever he sets his goal to. So the stretch goals always come come in and you get a lot of cool stuff in addition. So we got this uh, Do Not Disturb door sign, door hanger, still little princess on the back, cannibal kitty, oh no. Yeah, Cannibal Kitty on the front. Oh, yikes, nipples. Jesus. Hopefully they don't catch that. <laughs> uh, digging in further. We have the Cannibal Kitty pen. And, yeah, when you turn it upside down, she gets naked. I believe. <laughs> so that's super cool. 
I will look at that closer shortly. I'm just going to dump this stuff out here so I can pick it all up. Yeah, so, got a couple pogs with some characters from the book. You probably can't really see those, but they're cool. And this is uh, sweet stickers. Uh, again, I'll show you the clean version. Campbell Kitty. There's also a risque version that is topless here that comes with it. I got the Pope Kitty magnet. Very cool. An homage to the Pulp Fiction cover. Oh, sweet. This is going on the vest. The Cannibal Kitty patch. Look at that. That's, that's going right on the battle vest. And last but not least, oh, that's red. This is a enamel fig pin, figure pin of Little Six Cannibal Kitty in all her glory. And that's going to look red on the jacket too. We'll see which one, which jacket that one goes on. But, so yeah, as you see, they deliver high quality. You know, I've, I know some people are uh, reluctant to back Kickstarters. I've had bad experiences on Kickstarters before too, but never with Dan, never with Still Ill. These guys always come through. These are great books. Great art, high quality merchandise, everything here, all this stuff. The shirt, I mean, I had no idea what kind of shirt it was going to come on, and it's on a top, next level, top quality t-shirt. So... Great stuff. Shout out to Dan Mendoza, Nightmare Lynch, and Still Ill Princess. Can't wait to dig in, read the books, and review them. And I look forward to interviewing you guys soon. So, in the meantime, hit subscribe, everybody. Hit subscribe. And keep checking back starting, uh, you know, we have a lot of programming coming up starting very soon. If it's not already started, this will air after February 1st, most likely when we kick off our first full season of HP USA TV. So, subscribe, and we'll see you soon. Stay spooky, deviates.